hard to argue with the decision. As you said, Gilberto making the difference again. Toro getting to the ball first. I think it's Gilberto who's going to take it right now. And you are right in thinking so. Gilberto standing over the ball. Roman Williams reminded to remain on his line by the referee. Of course, if he comes off, VAR will spot it and the penalty kick would be retaken if he had made the save, of course. So now, Gilberto versus Williams. A deep breath. Now, can he hold his nerve? Gilberto saved by Williams and the rebound as well. Williams the hero once again for Sundowns and he punches the air and is rightly mobbed by his teammates. <laughs> it's rather unfortunate to uh, give it to uh, miss the penalty. You know, he's, he's the best player on the field right now. He, he will be very, very sad right now. It's psychologically, it's going gonna, it's gonna to affect him right now. Could be an interesting combination in attack, but it is still Sundowns doing the most of the attacking. A lovely ball over the top, which is brought down by Mkelize. Laid off, and it's through to Allende. And we do finally have a break to the deadlock. And it's Sundowns who've made good on their recent pressure. And Marcelo Allende, who's found the net finally in the high fives. Understandably, on the sidelines, Rilani Mokwena will have enjoyed that. <laughs> He's a master tactician. I think he came in this game to frustrate them, to make sure the players are calm, to keep possession, to run behind the defense. And that is what exactly the game plan was. Well, VAR will check that offside. I think he's just about in line. Should be okay. It was that ball over the top that they hadn't really been able to make the most of up to this point. It was brought down by Mkelize. Mendieta then picking out the right ball. And Marcelo Allende with the touch. And then firing into the top corner. Nothing Hugo Marquez could do. Been producing impressive performances recently, Allende. And now another one in the African Football League. Captain Chile at the 2015 FIFA Under-17 World Cup and was team's top goal scorer. He was considered one of the top youth prospects in Chilean football. Made just the one cap so far, but this may be another demonstration of just what he can do on the big occasion. And the pause in proceedings whilst VAR check four offside nervous moments but the goal confirmed whilst also still threatening with a bit of fresh energy in attack then they'll be looking good for the remainder and could this be the second and it is one of those fresh legs and rounding the keeper and immediately Maseko finding the second as appeals from Hugo Marquez Sundowns are still celebrating though. VAR will check it. Instant impact from Maseko. Mokwena very happy with that decision. <laughs> exactly, you know, the, tactically he's a tactician. Um, everything he, he wanted to do, he's got a um, this changes was what I was expecting. He did it. And then um, he has the results right now. He feels like he's in control of the, over the game and he needs a centre forward to kill the game. And that is what we, we, we just saw right now. Well, it was another tight call on the offside. I think just about level, once again, will be checked by VAR. But all credit to the substitutes. Maseko onto the ball with the calm head to take it round the keeper. And then still a fair amount of work to do from there. A narrow angle, but he kept his head. And now surely sundowns in pole position in this tie, 2-0 up and 10 minutes remaining and heading back to South Africa, it would appear, with a comfortable lead. Still we wait though, for confirmation of the goal. A glimmer of hope for Petro. And Hugo, Hugo nearly risked uh, my red card right there because uh, his tackle was a bit um, harsh. If the player had gone down, uh, he would have risked a, a, a penalty, a, yeah. a red card. Yeah, well out of his box and of course last man as the keeper. It's a good point. He didn't bring down 
Maseko, though. And he stayed on his feet and found the net. Patiently we wait for confirmation. There was another player who went into the book during the discussions after. Wait to see who that was, but look what it means to Rolani McQuayna. They had to wait in this game. They were patient. They rode the storm in the first half when Petro had the better of things. They had a scare, they survived it. And how different do you think things could be? Well, there's the confirmation. <laughs> in case it wasn't clear, made very clear by McQuayna's reaction. It is 2-0, two, two Sundowns.